have a lot to learn. Um, and what I want to do is take you through a very quick journey, or a, 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 yeah, use this as an opportunity to tell you about our journey the, since 2014 today, and what we have, uh, or the approaches that we have taken to learn, to review our processes. Okay, I'm the sort of person when you say funga, right? <laughs> that might be me, right? Before you get too carried away with it, you face the security. The reason why we have all this fantastic amount of money to give away at the moment is because of a government cynical plan. In my experience, you see that uh, there's actually a combination of European knowledge, European expertise coming to collaborate with us, dominating. The discussions, and uh, we see that this is not very, it's not, it's not very good. Funders' priority may neglect the, the development agenda, and the lack of uh, commitment of partners. Once the, the once the first phase of the project is completed, it is not continued. We think it's important to look beyond um, the issues of decolonization to inequalities within countries in the global south. Um, so I think it's, it's important when we think about um, decolonizing systems that we think beyond individual practice into um, research funding. To deliver excellent research in a robust way while still trying to manage those constraints and, and it puts pressures on every part of the 